I'm like shaking right now. This literally fell into me right now. Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a very important message that I wanted to share with you guys, but first coffee out of my super cute new cat and star and moon tumbler. This message is not sponsored by any means. This is just me sharing something that I'm really passionate about that I would love for you guys to support if you can. I recently stumbled upon a TikTok page for the rescue cat group called Perfect Paws. They're also known as Luna 13. If you guys didn't know this about me, I used to rescue the death row cats from the very high kill shelters of New York City. All of the cats I've ever had throughout my lifetime are rescued cats and I know a lot of you guys are also rescue people so I do want to share what I have been doing to help this rescue group. These rescue groups are so important because TNR is like critical for these stray cats. This group is responsible for feeding many of the stray cats in their area as well as spaying and neutering to ensure that there's no more kittens being born into this world that are going to suffer. So this really cool color changing tumbler that you see right here is totally my vibe and I feel like you guys would really love it as well and I wanted to share some of their merch from their Etsy. They have tarot card shirts and they also have these really cute tumblers that I feel like you guys would absolutely love. It is such an amazing way to help them out but with that being said I want to host another giveaway for some of their merch. So if you guys are interested and you live in the U.S. and would love a tarot cat kitty shirt or one of these cute cat tumblers just comment down below with your email so that I can email you if I do choose you as the winner right now they are struggling to get their views on TikTok and while I see a lot of other rescues getting views and people donating to them I just don't see that same support for this group and it really breaks my heart right now the rescue is trying to raise the funds for a cat named Chester an orange boy you guys know how much I love my orange babies I lost my sweet orange boy who was only nine years old to heart failure just about a year ago now we're going on a year aside from that they do feed the entire stray colony and there are accidents that pop up quite often because stray cats are very susceptible to the elements as well as cars and other diseases from just living on the streets. Chester has a really bad infection and a hurt leg and he has been sitting uh, I guess in the shelter or at the vet for a while now without the funds to treat him. It breaks my heart because I was talking to the woman who is in charge of this rescue and she puts her heart and soul into this. She has taken out loans to help these cats. I'm going to leave a link for their Amazon wish list, which is just basic supplies to feed the colony, as well as their Vemo. Right now, they are trying to raise an additional $150, I believe, to finally get Chester the help that he needs. But I need to show you guys this tarot card t-shirt, so let me show you. It's a tarot kitty cat shirt. This is such the vibe. You guys know this is totally me. Anyway, guys, you have showed such an immense amount of support for so many things throughout the years for me, and I would love to get back to other people and animals in need. So I would love for you guys to just at least head over to their TikTok, give them a follow, comment on some of their videos just with some love and support because it is a very hard thing to do to take care of sick, injured animals in need. It really affected my mental health for many years and I know that it's a very hard thing. I just want to do whatever I can to support them and I really hope that you guys will go and check out their TikTok. Thanks for listening guys and let's just get into today's spooky video. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I'm here with Kelsey Davies, and we are at the world famous clown motel. We are returning. We were here a couple years ago. We experienced so much wild paranormal activity. There were spirits that were grabbing us in our sleep, and we even had rocks thrown at us in the cemetery. And so a chair. It was probably one of the most wild crazy. nights. <laughs> but the clown motel has been visited by Ghost Adventures and many other paranormal groups over time. We have a room here for the night, and we're gonna sleep here hopefully nothing grabs us in our sleep please no but the history here guys is intense there was a lot of death here the Tonopah cemetery is right next door to us where the Belmont fire victims were laid to rest as well as many children who died of diseases there were also a couple of terminally ill people that came out to the clown motel and passed away here this was their final resting place so I hope you guys are excited for tonight's video I'm nervous too based on what happened last time but without further ado guys let's just get into tonight's spooky video Ooh. 
All right, I hope you guys are ready. Let's take a look at our room. Okay, so first off, we are in room 214 and we have a really cool themed room. Kelsey, what do we have? We have Jason. Yeah, Her so. Pillow. And Killer Clowns from Outer Space. Yeah. So, Killer Clowns from Outer Space, man. How cool is this? And then we have this epic skull up here. Don't know what creepy. that's doing it's there. Creepy, but epic at the same time. And then we have Jason. He's going to be sleeping with us. With me because you put me next to him. I didn't mean Chris that. Just naturally I didn't oh, mean that's not on the bed anymore, but it was. I'll sleep there. I kind of want to sleep there. I'm going to sleep there. <laughs> no, me. There was a lady in here, by the way. Kelsey thought I was standing right by Jason, yeah. and I, in fact, was in the bathroom. So I walked in. Okay, I had just smoked a J, you know, so I walked in. And I looked, so she's really high. But there's a lady in here. <laughs> it kind of enhances my gifts. Like, it doesn't, yeah. I understand that, because you're more like focused. Enhances, yeah, I'm more yeah. focused and stuff, but I'm also caught off guard a lot. So yeah. I walked in. And I saw a lady standing right here, kind of like Jason. She was kind of standing like this, and I thought it was Chris, so I went to talk to her. And I was like, I, I literally started talking, and Chris is in the bathroom. She goes, what? And then I realized, because I looked at her, I walked, I, I would think I was grabbing my necklace or something, and I turned back, and like, I realized that wasn't Chris. And I was like, Chris, I just saw a lady. But she put her hair up. <laughs> and I was like, I did not see no lady. Yeah, you're like, my impression of myself. <laughs> so actually, guys, Kelsey and I were here a couple years ago and yeah. we had some crazy experiences downstairs experiences. though we did stay i believe in room 108 where ghost adventures yeah. stayed that i feel a lot better in here but still there is definitely energy in here for sure we were both touched in our sleep we slept in the same bed horrible. yeah her leg was pulled off the bed my leg oh was my pulled God, off the there's bed there's someone right here someone oh, just no. came in there's two spirits in here right now there's someone right here i just saw him in a jacket a dark jacket i think it was like a brown i I feel like we're kind of magnets for that because one we're very open to it and two we're both very sensitive to the spirit realm so i am really curious to see what is going to happen tonight josh went and picked up some of his equipment i'm, like texting him. I'm like there's now two spirits <laughs> i think we might just start in here i don't know yeah, there's so there's much two to spirits do who are ready for talking and we get to go to the lobby guys there are clowns from all over the world yeah. here at the world famous clown and hotel and a lot of them are haunted as well and some are not so nice there are two spirits in here. Right now? We just yeah. There's yeah. Right and a woman. Guys, this is Exploring oh, with hey Josh. Hey guys, we're chilling. And we have Seth. Just Seth. What's up? <laughs> um, yeah, so. He's related to the ex murderer yeah, Lizzie Borden. Like yeah? Yeah. No yes. way. Yeah. Oh. yeah, it's my sixth cousin. Wait, what? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Somebody told me this. Okay, so, wait, 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 who I told didn't put me this, this together? But Seth Borden. How do you feel? What are you feeling? I feel like the people that were here were very lonely, didn't have a lot of family or friends, which is why they came to this hotel to basically die. So just us being here, open-minded to the spirits that are here and just kind of welcoming them. I feel like we're gonna have a lot of activity tonight because of that, for Do you sure. I feel like the woman was super sick and came here like very depressed. I get a lot of depressing energy and a lot of loneliness and honestly that like just the history and if you read online yeah. a lot of the rooms there was just a lot of terminally ill patients that came yeah. here for whatever reason I mean, this is an area to get away yeah what yeah. are you feeling oh put me on the spot yeah. what are you I feeling know. seth feels things i know seth I just, is very empathic a, yes what do you feel like how's the energy in this room i don't know um i mean since i've rolled up here i feel kind of anxious but i also do get like that when i meet new people so I, oh, okay, that could be you. it and there's two cameras like on him. i know we're like Josh, what do you think is yeah, going to go down think? tonight? So, I think because our energy is really good tonight, we're not tired, we're going yes. in hard. I think ghosts and everyone's spirits are going to feed off of this. Yes. It's going to help them. It's yeah. going to drain us a bit, but we're going to be able to speak to everyone tonight. It's, it's going to be a good energy. night. Like, these guys have such great yeah. energy. Make sure you guys go subscribe. Don't even think about closing out of this video <laughs> yeah. because we're all good vibes, guys. Exactly. Good vibes all the way, and we're going to have an epic night. Things are already starting to happen, so yeah. why don't we get some of the gear? set up turn on and just see what the hell happens okay so kind of some bad news guys i thought that i had jack ship 
I'm really upset about it. I thought that I grabbed the box. My grandma overnighted Jack. He was in New Jersey. I haven't seen him in about three months. I was gonna bring him to the Clam Hotel. He's been wanting to come here for forever. I've been wanting to bring him. And of course, I grabbed the wrong box. And when I opened the box in the car, it was a backpack that I had ordered. She was telling me about this really cool, like, scream backpack she got. And then she manifested it into the car. Poor Chris. No. I was so upset, though. <laughs> Honestly, Jack, and you guys probably remember Jack. He is such a cool spirit. He's a freaking clown. He needs to be here. Jack's not here. I'm sorry, guys. But I will do my best to film more videos with him and also hopefully bring him back to the world famous clown motel. We we're here. We were having an it like a situation with the REM pod specifically on the beds. He's sit literally sitting on the, the bed. The REM pod kept That's going off on the one here. bed. Wait, bro, do that again. Move it. Dude, I need to see that. Look, look, see look, the, it the signal changes. Yeah. And then that's unbelievable, dude. There I, is I a man sitting on the bed. There's, oh. Yeah, right there. there's a man sitting on the bed, and that's crazy. He is not here, and he's here. You're we like in him. You're like inside of him. Yeah, I know. No. I like literally am like in his <laughs> gut. Seriously. Last time we were here, though, we had so much activity with the K2 meter on the bed. Again, if you think about it, terminally ill people would come here. Where do you think they passed away? Facts. In the bed. So yeah, that's that one thing. So this is something too, because like when we came here, we were talking like, okay, like all we know is that there's a great Graveyard here, it doesn't explain why this place would be haunted, but it makes sense that this place has still been around before it was a clown motel. Yeah, so like people that. would have died on the beds yeah. or other places, or like you said, the terminal people. Like I wasn't yeah. thinking that people actually just died in the hotel room. Well, I mean, we, right. didn't, we, we weren't didn't thinking know of about terminally ill people dying here, so that's really so this is just new for us. So now this hotel yeah, is kind of gosh. evolving. Get with it, man. More haunted than I'm expecting. <laughs> I'm stuck on my tripod. <laughs> <laughs> I'm stuck what? on my what tripod. Dude, my camera didn't record like any of any that. Of that. Okay guys, so we literally just got here and literally everything is starting. It's starting to get cold, the EMF meter's going off. It's starting. We are summoning the spirits of the clown motel. I'm calling out to the man, also the woman that was in here. If you want to come forward, if you want to touch that device, you're more than welcome to. We welcome you in, but we only want love and light. Absolutely no negativity is welcome. What are you doing? I thought someone was knocking. We're opening the door for them. They're politely asking to come in. You can come in. Is there anybody here that wants to hang out with us tonight? Is the man still on the bed? Oh my God, yes. And it's completely off here. He is just sitting right here. Cause it's just so solid. I've never seen that before. I know, and it's just right I'm like, here. Like, like a really strong spirit, but I don't know. He's hanging out here. He's chilling. That's so weird. I've never yeah. seen it do that. I do feel like this woman is trying to talk to us because she really never had anyone to talk to. It's this like She's overwhelming sad. sensation of loneliness, and it really is sad. It honestly just like breaks my heart for her. I'm almost getting emotional thinking about it. Just thinking about people's final days here at the Cloud Motel. Hotel. Back yeah, in the of day, places, like the clown motel. was it the clown motel then? Though? It, back in the day, this was kind of a dumpy place. Like the new owner bought it and kind of revamped it and made these really cool rooms that you guys see now. Why would you come out here? There's nothing. There wasn't even food for us to eat last time we were here. But I guess they just really wanted that seclusion. Oh. It's almost like it's confirming like what I'm talking yeah, about, I mean, it's been right? On for so long. Yeah. Can your energy make that go off for us? Just get a little bit closer to it. Hello? Hello? Are you the man that I saw? I don't know. I feel like that woman was kind of confirming on the REM pod yeah. right now as I was talking about kind of what it was like for her here. Maybe she's a little apprehensive too of the equipment. So I'm wondering if it'll be easier to come through on like the spirit box or something. You missed it, dude. There's Bro. so much happening right Bro. now. Wait, no, I got it. This was- Oh, I'm like literally oh, standing in your camera. Okay, I'm no, sorry. Good. Pod is now going off. I was actually changing the batteries of my mail meter. Well, was... What did you guys ask? What so, was the question? He was like, what do you think of like, do you think that they're together? Do you think like, what do you think of them? And I was like, I, I think that they both came in separate. They died separate. Yeah. They maybe know each other now, but right. they came in to see what we were doing because they're curious. Yeah. And also right before that, I was like, I think they're trying to warm up to us. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. There That's you go. Confirmation right there. That's crazy. Are you guys feeling comfortable around us? Okay, guys. Ooh, so, yes. Holy crap. Dude, no, mine never does this. Who is that? Can you stop? If it's the woman, can you step away for a minute? If it's the 
if it's the man, can you step away for a minute? Okay, is it someone else? Is there a third spirit here right now? Kind of went on faster that time. Really? Like, someone else. Yeah, like, there's like, quite a bit of activity right now. I mean, they're just constantly sitting. It's going hand in hand with the EMF, remember. Like, look, look, look. whoa. That's going, dude! What the hell? Look at her. What is happening? There, there is someone oh like her. I've never, really. dude, this is unbelievable. What? Stop. Guys, Stop. look at, oh my god, what is happening? Stop. My Mel meter is going crazy in this REM pod. It's coming in hot. This, this is the craziest crazy. thing I've ever experienced. I'm not even to say it. Like, I don't even know what to Stop. say. Oh my god, what is happening? Wow. I have well, never that's seen not true. Oh, that stopped at the same that exact took time. Two times yeah. to reset that. I have never oh, seen yeah. more activity. Oh, Why is that happening? Dude. <gasps> Guys! Oh, no God. matter where we put it! The no millimeter's going stopped. off because Kelsey reset her REM pod, so now he's so now over here. here. He's like, I don't think so. What happened, Kelsey? Happened. Oh my god, ew. Something moved back there, fell off the yeah. bed. I saw something really What did you see? I'm like shaking right now. Like I saw something. It was crawling on the floor. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my god, I hated that. <gasps> oh. The music box is oh. going off. Off, oh, guys, over by where I saw it. Could have been Seth, Could maybe. Been wait, yeah, how was that you? I don't know. Okay, no, that oh, wasn't wait. you. Oh, okay. I can hit six feet. They okay, have this so music box. it looked like a dog, but I can tell you it was not a dog. Yeah. I don't know what that. Like, I have not seen something like that. I had to like take a minute to. <laughs> what? That was a dog. dog that was well, crazy. I don't know what it is. You heard that? <laughs> Cause it was literally a dog. I'm just gonna it say this white, right now. It was this white crawling thing. I have like, the chills. I'm so uncomfortable. Weird. If there is something that negative awesome. in here, do you think it's negative, Kelsey? Yeah. Yeah. So if there is something negative I in here, you you are not, not kidding. I don't. You know. are not welcome I, in I, here. I think what? it's a, a skinwalker. <laughs> oh no. No. I'm not even Oh my god, I have chills like, all over my body. Like I, I have that goosebumps was the everywhere. Thing I've ever and then we like heard a dog. Shit I've ever fucking oh seen. Let's try this. What if we just try like a session I'm where we ask questions shaking. one at a time and just listen? I wanna know out. what that was. Oh I mean the fact is when you heard it and then it barked, it That's validated wild. it because that was weird. Yeah, well, that is scary. Yeah, skin, <laughs> skinwalkers yeah. will do that. And we are out in the oh, yeah. desert in skinwalker really territory. Was this room here. With that. that was a little scary skeptical of like skinwalkers and stuff, but I don't know what the f that, I don't know how else to describe what I just saw. That made me feel physically sick. I had chills up and down my body. If there is negative energy in this room, you are not welcome I to not interfere like with our energy. You are not allowed to touch us. You have to stay away. We are setting a boundary. It I don't want anything fun. following us home. Oh if it was God. a dog, it was a really ugly looking dog. Yeah, but then it barked, which is, that thing is manifesting. Oh, wait. You're not allowed to say that word out loud, but I did. Oh, I said it like five, you're not supposed to say that out loud. Say that. That's oh. why I said walker initially. I guess we're not supposed to say I take that. it back. It's too late. No. I've had enough shit happen this past year. You better leave me the f alone. All right, guys, we are about to go lights out. We're going to do a session and see what else happens. Here. We're about to do a session. We're gonna go around in the group and ask some questions. We have all the gear laid out. So, I just heard a woman. oh my god, I, I'm like getting the Irish chills right now, like in my ear. Recording now. So, who's here uh, following us? That said, help. What do you need help with? I almost feel like the woman is overwhelmed by the other energy here. There's something kind of holding her back. Like, I just do not feel right. And I, I, I'm concerned for her. I'm concerned for her spirit being trapped here. Like, something's holding her here. Is something holding you here? What is your name? What? What? What the f Okay, this is weird shit. Huh? I can't breathe. Like, there was I a gust breathe. of wind next. Me. And I thought someone was coming to get me. <laughs> so I was, I was like, looking at you and I'm like, oh. Did you die here? The woman? Yeah. I feel like she's happy that we're here because she feels like almost protected having us here. All right, we're going to see. We're going to play back the voice recordings here. Okay, here we go. We have to listen. <laughs> Ooh, 
heard a yes. Yes, something's holding me here. Martha? What is your name? Martha. Martha. That said Martha. I knew we were communicating to her yeah. right away. So she feels so comfortable around us. She's happy right now. Yeah. She's so Yeah, happy. she's so comfortable right now. She's like smiling. Yeah, that's like, what I was just like, saying. She's sitting next to you. Yeah, she likes she, our energy. Yeah, she feels protected and like... She feels safe here. Whoa. Yeah. So all we got out of that whole thing, as far as I know, is there's a woman named Martha, and maybe she could have died here. We don't know. We got to replay and do it again. All right, so when we go into this one, let's ask like, what, you know, like stuff about Martha. Yeah. And see what we can uncover. Safe, things yeah. like yeah. that. Yeah. Let's like really try, try to get to know her. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Martha, did you die here? Were you sick? Martha, do you feel safe around us? Who's here that you do not like? How old are you, Martha? Are you showing me your sister? Is there a skinwalker or a dog roaming this room right now? Are we in danger? Yeah, we don't hear like cats. Yeah, yeah. Right yeah. everywhere, all around. She kept There's showing me a, a woman. I was wondering if it was her sister or a lover. I don't know. She seems pretty talkative. Yeah, I, she is though. If right? anything, we could use like the spirit box too, but this okay. is like. Great. We could do spirit box after this. Whoa, that was what yeah. Was that? Yes. Whoa, that was clear as hell. <laughs> So I get visions of things when they speak to me. They show me things a lot Whoa. of times. Whoa! What did that say? She was showing me her sister. Watch, just put it against your ear. Watch when she answers that question. Oh, it's the skinwalker! Oh my god. God, I just have the chills. Oh my I'll god. I'll play it again, watch. Okay, I have goosebumps everywhere. It. I heard it. Here he's down. That said skinwalker. You hear it, skinwalker. The thing is, you're, you've been validating good yeah, stuff. That's been, yeah. Yeah. It's been right this whole just, time so far. Yeah. yeah. So we're just going to do a spirit box session uh, with the spirit box app that we use. It is available for iPhone and Android. If you guys are interested in using it, I will have the links down below in the description. Use responsibly. Energy manipulates energy, I'll okay? I'll literally hear them say something, and then it comes through on the app. It is bizarre. It's so accurate. We use that to conjure us. Remember how accurate? it was if you watched Definitely the other channel check this out. it literally is a, a real insane. spirit box app insane. and i don't know how ghosts can even what's your theory on that how, how ghosts can go through I a think, spirit box app i think that there's just like so i think that they have like kind of a voice box like you'll hear things repeat and stuff every once in a while but that's like they manipulate those sounds yeah. you think about it radios have not as much energy and waves as phones like phones are like True. intense why wouldn't they be able to use it's this an, box? It's a good theory. It's, Spirits manipulate energy to communicate, yeah. and like they don't have a voice box, so like they have to communicate by manipulating energy, which is why they get close to the REM pod. It goes off, and we'll ask questions and get very intelligent responses. I mean, already tonight it's good, so I, I don't doubt we're not going to get anything yeah. good today. Yeah, I think we're going to get some intelligent responses. Me here. too. I some that. answers to our questions. That. I think so. Yeah. Is Martha still here? <laughs> it said hello. It said hello. Oh, did, I don't, did you hear that? I yeah. Scared the crap I out of me. Martha. Hi. Turn around. Uh, I'm not gonna do that. That's where <laughs> that something. Did that just say my? I heard Seth. Dude, there, no, that said turn around and there sitting was, behind Seth? There's literally something, there's something behind you right now. Yep. Oh, I physically it. saw something, someone behind you. There's actual like flowing energy. Do you like <laughs> Seth's energy? Do you want us to see you? Do you want us to notice you? No. No. Yes. Yes. No, so any yes. There's like, yeah, there's I feel like there's a lot going on. Is it okay that we're here? No. I only Try. want Martha to come through. Hello. Martha, why are you showing me your sister? Yeah. You say I love you. Love you. I heard, yeah, I heard love you. Maybe there's a message you. for her sister. No. Is your sister deceased? Yeah. 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 Maybe she can't find her sister and she's like stuck here, but she she's, is. you want to idea. find her. She's literally right there. I see like a full <coughs> white apparition. Yes, white, white, white. She's wearing a white dress. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Who's the little boy you're showing me? That was a kid's voice and it said, said me. Someone is walking back there. Is there something in the back corner right now looking at us? Um, Say back. What's up with that 
that area. Maybe there's like a portal yeah. or something. I don't want to go sit back mm -hmm. there. Should we go yeah, in right. the back corner? Is there a portal over there? Don't. I almost wonder if the little boy awesome. is from. Yeah, I was feeling that. I feel like he died of like yeah. a disease. Yeah. I feel like he got. I think he's. I think he got like a yellow fever. <laughs> Did the little boy get sick with the? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Are there any miners here? Did you die in the fire in 1911? Yes. yes. Clear yes. Okay. Great Can you job. say Josh? That's a Chris. It's all said yeah. Josh. I literally it just said Chris. It's a Chris. Uh, I, Lola, I didn't hear Lola. Lola came through. She goes, Lola. <laughs> Lola's like, I'm here Lola's too, like, guys. Hi, I'm Lola. Goodbye. 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 Goodbye.
There's some weird shit in here, man. So we have an ovulus here. So it's basically a word box and they can yeah. manipulate it to oh, say clock. certain words. What did clock. it say? Clock. Oh, there's a clock. We're calling out to any spirits who want to come forward. We come here with the utmost respect. We wish that only love and light comes through. We don't want anything negative to come through. Bind. 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 We're in a bind. Like I'm in a bind. Or spirits bind to objects. That's we're in a room where spirits are attached to the clowns that are sent in from all around the world. That's very true. Is is there a spirit here that's attached to a clown here? Yours. 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 I can feel you here. We're not here to make fun of you in any way. We're here with respect. If you want to let yourself be known. Trickery. Trickery. Clown. Yeah, like, seriously. Oh, trickery. That's yeah. something. How Spiritual. the heck is there a dragonfly in here? I guys? don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! It's just a dragonfly! What are you doing? Oh, it's on you! It's for you. Oh my god, wait, where is it? Where? It's, on it's, on your lip. <gasps> it's a sign. What up, oh, wait, is that a dragonfly? No, oh, that's it's a, a moth. moth. Oh, wow. <laughs> wait, the other one was a dragonfly. I this saw is a dragonfly. This isn't the. I don't know what the. F this oh is. my god! But that's wait, a. Why, that's why does so Josh funny. get a dragonfly and I get a moth? <laughs> <laughs> Josh, are you more scared of the the clowns or are you more scared of the moth? The moths. They're, they're huge. I like this big. I swear there was a dragonfly. It looked too. like a dragonfly. No, no, no there were. I swear. <laughs> All right, we're back, guys. Yeah, we're back. We're back. We're back, back on track. Here we go. What is your favorite clown here? Can you? Make a noise by it. Plane. Is there, is there a clown something by a plane? plane? We're looking for a clown with a plane. The energy in here is very draining. It's can almost you hurting show my us eyes. Where, can you, Chris, did you touch this? It's no. swinging. What's swinging? This no, one. I didn't touch. I have my video's been recording the whole time for five minutes. So if it, I can, no. you know what I mean. I didn't cut it. I didn't it's touch that. It's That's literally crazy. swinging. Whoa. That's cool. Oh, I just heard someone take a huge breath yeah. right back here in the corner. They're like, <gasps> You heard it? Yeah. I wonder if my camera picked it up. I'm sure it did. I'm actually going to put this here and see if it does anything. So we have the Jack in the Boxes, the old clown music boxes as well. Oh, Lola, you put her next to the evil clowns, Kelsey. Chris, I think something just said my name. Who's here with us? So, can you say your name loud and clear for us? I just heard a little girl so loud. It wasn't coming from the center box, it was coming from over here. I it was Jordy. It's just so interesting because these clowns come from all over the world. So you would think that this would be a really active area, but I don't know. It's like before, like the calm before the storm. Jordy's here. I think she's going to pull through. Jordy, can you please play with the devices like you did last time? Look at all of our stuff, guys. Are you guys upset that we're here? That said stupid doll. Is there a doll in here you don't like? Is it fingers? I think that said, yeah. His fingers, the big doll. I will follow you. No, you will not follow us. <laughs> You're not welcome to follow us anywhere. You have to stay here. You want to play? I heard play. We're calling out to spirits who want to come communicate with us. We're giving you a voice. You can use the energy from the lights. Maybe everyone introduce yourselves. Yeah. My name's Chris. My name's Josh. My name is Seth. There's a weird energy here. Yeah. It's like something's like, don't do Flashlight. It did say flashlight. And the flashlight did go off before. It did, it did. Did I just hear get out? That said Jack and then Chris, I swear. The entity that I saw earlier, the one who gave me a headache, we want to talk with you. It's getting like hard to breathe. We heard that laugh in here before. Who was that? Something just fell that behind just me. Fell. Yeah, it did. Something just freaking fell behind me. It was. What was it? What was it? I don't know. It was a doll. Yeah, I didn't. Doll. I'm not sitting the doll on this. Fell. Oh my god! What? Like literally. Oh. You heard that? Heard what was that? Or so footstep now. Do you like this one? Can you make the devices go off? Are you able to do that? I heard no. Why can't you communicate with the devices? The so what? The balance is great. The balance is I heard yeah. you too. Yeah. Do you want us to leave? We're gonna go into our own corners here. Okay, right, I'm gonna grab this sensor. I'm gonna put it back here, actually, with the doll. Maybe this doll is like active. I don't I don't know. Yeah, what's going on with the REM pod? Is someone upset that we're here? Sound like I heard a man. 
A lot of people say this place has a lot of evil entities. Can you prove that to us? It's eerily quiet, like something is wrong. <laughs> I mean, it, it's- quiet. Someone it's just said, hey, did oh. you hear that? Why okay, you let's give that? Kelsey's spirit box a, sh a shot here. What's wrong? Is someone able to cross the rods in my hands? Oh. Whoa. Are you the woman that we keep hearing on the spirit box? Can you cross for yes and open them for no? Yeah. Mm. Are you Martha? No. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying. Yeah. You're doing happening. great. Yeah, thank you. Are you buried out in the cemetery? Yeah. Yes. Where can we talk to people? Where will people come through to talk with us? Dude, the graveyard's in that Look that. Like, are you sure it's not grave. like the kitchen? Yeah. No, the graveyard. the graveyard. Oh, it's a grave. It's no, a grave. The graveyard is good. that way. We're gonna go now. Is there anything you'd like to say to us before we leave here? I was what? All right, we're gonna head out then. If there's nothing more that we you want to talk to us about. I heard help. I heard help. What the heck was that? The entire room just shifted behind us. Right? It felt like I everything behind too, yeah. us. I think we should just go. So the weirdest thing, Kelsey and I went to go get Josh and Seth in their room and they were down here the entire time and there was a loud, obnoxious bang that came from behind the door. I thought that they were like messing with us, but they were down here the entire time. And now we're heading to the cemetery. So maybe that's telling of what's to come. I don't know. I've never even investigated a cemetery. This really? is my first one ever. What? Yeah. And this is the coolest one too. It so. looks cool. It's super old, that's for sure. All right, here we go, guys. Let's head back into the Tonopah Cemetery. There's an unopened white claw. No way. It's unopened? Yep. Oh man, it's like an offering, it but is. they didn't have white claw back then. What would they have had? Like moonshine. Moonshine, yeah. Kelsey, what are we doing here? I don't know. I felt something here, so I sat down. We got the equipment. We got some candles. We're at some of the graves right now. Oh, is it going off? off? Oh man. Bro, what? Something's here. Oh. See? So we're calling out to the spirits of Tonopah Cemetery. We're here to get to know you and your story. Is there anything you can do to show us that you're here with us? I keep seeing like shadows. Is that going There's off? There's someone there. Dude, what the hell is going That's off That's still going off, guys. You moved it. It's like someone's just walking around through the yeah. graveyard. Whoever's behind me, you can come forward to me. How many people are here with us? I just keep hearing. Say eight? Yeah. 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 The K2 meter is going off in like random off. spots. Yeah. Is Josh around energy? There. 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 There's obviously no EMF. Like, no. Elsie, no. did you hear that? Keep who was, throwing, who was okay? throwing rocks at us when we were here last time? Who threw the chair? Is that going to happen again? Yep. Oh, I don't like yeah, that. Yeah, it was like a gun or something. Yeah. I don't like that at all. How did you die? Is that okay if I ask that? It's not like a lot. Yeah. Were you trapped in the mine fire? There were like 74. How many I heard 74. Die? He's coming? He's coming. He's coming, yeah. Who's coming? What's happening to me? Dead? That's what that just said. What's happening to me? Do you not understand that you're not alive anymore? No. no. There's someone coming to me and they got shot. I think they got shot in the stomach and I just keep feeling them stumbling. Like, I keep feeling that it's so weird. I keep feeling the floor moving, like everything moving around me. It was really traumatizing the way this uh, man died that he's showing me. Surgery. Surgery. Did he need surgery? Were you murdered? Whoa. Oh, Say Josh. Are we friends? Are we friends? Oh, wow. Oh. What app is this? Josh just put this app. Spirit Talker. No, this is called Spirit Talker. Is it okay that we're talking to you? Can you tell us what your name is? Oh, Can you tell us your name again? Because Kelsey was being obnoxious with the REM pod. The noise was me. The noise was me! Whoa. What? Oh That's crazy, dude. I was like, Kelsey's being obnoxious with the REM pod. The noise was me! And it's like what? taking responsibility for like her dropping the REM pod because it like slipped out of her hand. Yeah. You know that? yeah. It's okay. We want to know that you're here. We want you to communicate with us yeah. in any way. Are there a lot of children spirits here? Are there just a lot of children? Is there anyone able to make our devices go off? What's 
Oh, that's that going was off. the pyramid. Yo, yours is going off. Oh, oh yes. It just started going off Gosh, behind us. You can actually see the me. green light. Yeah. That's over here. So now it's over here. Wow. Yeah, now it's over Guys, here. on either side, we have the sensor, the triangle sensor, and the one He's behind coming. Josh is going He's off. coming. Yes. yes, who's coming? What's your name? Ed. 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 What the f was Whoa. that? I don't know. I don't like that. I don't like when they whisper those long yeah. sentences. Like, what are you trying to say? That's not like a girl really upset. Listen. Intense. And she was screaming. Oh my god. And it's intense. intense. Who's the man that's coming here though? Should there, someone literally yeah. just walk across? Yeah, like, no, I keep uh, seeing weird Yeah. Shit. Honestly, I'm like kind of getting nervous about this man. Why is there so much suspense and like build up? Like everyone's like, yeah. he's coming. Like, why is he coming? Why is he so aggressive? Com the one coming from the. It's like he runs this. I don't know. It's kind of ready weird. or not. Intense. He's coming. Intense. It said ready no, or not. No way. You heard that? Yeah. Oh. No. What was that? Is he here yet? He left. He left. My blood. He left. Bad. My, my blood. blood. My blood. What the hell? It said he left. My blood. That's creepy. My Do we blood. intimidate him? Don't antagonize. Don't antagonize him. They're scared of him. They're like, damn. Oh my god, they shit. are warning us. They're guys. warning us. They're they freaking really are. warning us. They, they, they don't want us to like provoke him in, in any way to make him yeah. mad. What will happen if we antagonize him? Call out. Call out. What's he gonna to do? Him? They're kind of like, call out and see what happens. So I, I want to take on my EVP and see if we can hear like a clear response. Yeah. Run, Josh, run. run! Go get it! Run! <laughs> it just said run! Did it? No, it didn't! <laughs> Did it? Oh, yeah, dude! Alright, guys, so we're gonna do a voice recording here to see if the man will come through for us. Who's coming? Do you just like I'm to. On. I think he tries to pretend like he's demonic, like he's a demon. I think he tries to pretend like he's demonic, like he's a demon. Did you say yes? I a demon in the background, yes. I thought. Did you a demon? Yes. Like you're more powerful than you really are. He tries to appear like he's he's more powerful than he really is. Right. But yeah, I don't think it's demonic. I just think he's a really negative yeah. soul. Like not a negative soul, but he died he died a very traumatic death. So it's like he still holds on to a lot of that energy. Did something go back with Josh to the room? Do you have anything you want to say? I just heard laughing. Mm. What the fuck? That's so weird. Did you hear that? That, that's that was so loud. creepy. Creepy as hell. I don't like that. It was one of you laughing. That sounded like a laugh like, coming ah! from the other direction or just some kind of creepy. We heard laughing. We literally Healthy. heard it in person. Like it was like a laugh. We asked if something followed you back to the room and it like said. What did it like say? Growling. It said something. Like it was negative. 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 Right, negative. None's following me. Oh. Or it could be a negative. <laughs> oh. Yeah, true, oh. true. All right, all right. We play that round. Because we know that there's something negative here yeah. with us. So we're packing up. We're going to get ready for bed. Josh, how are you feeling no. about sleeping in that room? I mean, you guys said you heard stuff and I wasn't in there. There's a huge oh, a bang. Sound. Dang. I thought you guys are you stoked for tonight? Yeah, absolutely. I'm surrounded by clowns. It's gonna be great. It's lobby. We have to film ourselves like sleeping because like, yeah. I feel like it's gonna be some paranormal activity, like the movie stuff. Our sheets gonna come You're off. Gonna start levitating. <laughs> I kind of hope that would happen, actually. That'd Honestly, don't speak it into existence because yeah, yeah, last yeah, time we were here, the spirits were like pulling us out of bed. So what? just be careful what you say, man. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I'm not gonna say anything. <laughs> All right, we're gonna head to bed, guys. We'll catch up with you Ooh, in God the morning. Damn, <laughs> God damn, your room's haunted. Okay, so we're about to get some sleep. It's 3.30 in the morning, the witching hour. I will see you guys in the morning. <laughs> we're going to sleep at witching hour. That is what we're doing. Because <laughs> we're insane. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Hello?
So right here, the bed actually shook. What the f was that? Kelsey. Like, Dude, did you shaking. hit something? Please tell me you hit something. I'm like literally shaking. Why am I shaking? <clears throat> Stop. You need to leave. I didn't like that. Dude, oh, I fucking hated that. What was that? My arm, like why am I shaking? I don't know if I'm gonna be able to sleep tonight. I'm like scared. I'm so scared. <laughs> All right, guys, we survived the night Woo! here at the World Famous Cloud Motel, and I had some freaky stuff happen to me last night. Freaky I slept stuff. like a baby. Kelsey slept like a baby, but there was literally a shadow figure trying to manifest right behind me right here. It was pretty creepy. I'm curious to see what I caught while we filmed ourselves sleeping last night, but I really hope that you guys enjoyed this adventure to the Cloud Motel. Make sure that you guys are checking out the homies, Kelsey Davies, exploring with Josh and Seth Borden, and show that like button some love, guys. Yeah. We are heading over to the Miss Paw right now. We have a bunch more content coming at you and I will catch you guys super soon.